Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Ayana and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you've never seen my face before. In today's video, I wanted to give you guys kind of like a life update and also some of my current favorites because I haven't done a favorites video in like forever. I haven't really been uploading in quite a bit of time so I wanted to kind of update you on why I haven't been uploading as well. Let's get into that. I haven't posted a video in about three weeks and during that time I have been super depressed. I have been depressed for as long as I can remember but these past few weeks have really been different for me and probably the most depressed I've ever been. Just a lot of things have happened to me and it's like one thing after another thing after another thing so I spent a lot of my time um, sleeping, literally, I slept for three days straight. I've just been feeling really um, worthless. Um, I feel like I have no purpose. Um, I feel like I'm just taking up space and like breathing air that someone else who's actually deserving of a life could have. For the past maybe week or so, I've been like super suicidal and I've been suicidal before um, last time I had really serious thoughts about suicide I ended up in a mental facility for about a week to kind of like rehabilitate and um, get my mind in the right space um, and right now I don't have the means to go back to a facility like that even though I am um, feeling this way maybe I don't feel so strongly about suicide at the moment for a while that was the only thing that consumed my thoughts and I cried to my dad about it and I feel like when I cry to my dad about my feelings like it's real my dad has talked me down out of <laughs> talked me down um, or talked me out of a lot of situations I guess you could say if I ever want someone's like calm unbiased opinion about anything my dad is the person that I go to it may not be the answer or the response that I want but it's the most I guess real response I could get I love my dad and I appreciate my dad for everything he's done for me um, let me not cry <laughs> that has been a huge chunk of why I have not filmed a video there's still some things that need to be worked out but um I did have something good happen to me. Someone finally saw my potential and I got myself a full-time job. So i um, really excited to start there. Um, I'm a designer now and I've been a designer, but now I, you know, have the job to prove it. I think that's all the real, like, big updates. On to current favorite. I think, like I mentioned in a previous video, I don't really have the funds to experiment with like new beauty, new fashion, things like that. I'm gonna share with you um, beauty favorites first and then we'll get into fashion and music. Oh, and snacks. So the first beauty favorite I have is this um, Physicians Formula, the Healthy Foundation and it has SPF 20 in it. This is in the color DW2 and it's for all skin types. I think before I was using like a matte foundation and my thing is okay I think I realized that I don't actually have oily skin so why am I using matte product after like maybe an hour of where my skin started to look super dry and like crusty I've just been getting um, products that cater to all skin types and what I really love about this foundation is that it has a doe foot applicator. So the next beauty favorite I have is this NYX Dewy Finish Setting Spray. I was using the matte finish before and like I said, I don't have oily skin so the matte finish was not, you know, doing it for me. This dewy finish one, it gives me more of like a natural feel to my face. You can get it from Target, Ulta, your local H-E-B, super affordable and I love it. The last beauty favorite I have is actually um, for hair and I use this pretty much every day. It's the Garnier Fruity Sleek and Shine Anti-Frizz Serum with Argan Oil from Morocco and it's for frizzy, dry, unmanageable hair. Um, and I don't know if I could really vouch for the anti-frizz properties it claims to have, especially for like my leave out, um, just because of, I think it's just the humidity in Texas. My hair and humidity just do not mix. But what I do love about this product is that 
it leaves my hair super shiny looking super healthy looking and it also like has a nice scent to it let's get on into fashion favorites the first fashion favorite I have is this hat and it doesn't look like much but I literally wear this every time I leave my house if uh, I don't feel like doing my hair. This is just like a plain black baseball cap and I think I got it from Agassi or Agassi or whatever. The next fashion favorite I have still has my belt attached to it which I need a new one because this one is falling apart. These are these jeans that are from I believe Romway? And um, these were actually like gifted to me. I literally wear these everywhere and I feel like I need a new pair of boyfriend jeans because these are so freaking comfortable. These especially, I feel like you can dress them up or down and they just look amazing. And we got snacks. We got snacks. We got snacks. Hey, we got snacks. My first snack favorite currently, um, I just made this the other day and I was just like, where has this been on my life? It's this Tazo Ice Passion Tea. I love uh, the Passion Tea Lemonades from Starbucks, but they're like $4 for just the tall ones, it, which doesn't make sense because you take two sips and you're done. I love this. Um, you just like boil you some water, you know, um, and if you want to make a passion tea lemonade or like sparkling passion tea or whatever, um, you just make like half a pitcher of boiling water, let the bag seep in, and then um, you can add lemonade. I added Simply Lemonade and it tastes just like Starbucks. Like, get this. Another snack favorite I have are these caramel rice crisps from Quaker. And I never really was a huge fan of rice cakes because I remember um, a while ago my mom used to eat like plain rice cakes and I was like, what are these? Someone let me try one at work and I was like, these are mad good. They're like 120 calories. I mean, they're gluten free if you care, uh, made with whole grain and brown rice. Like, I mean, and they're delicious. Okay, music favorites. Currently, literally for the past two days, I've been listening to, is that what it's called? Three Strikes by Tara Jr. I guess their album's called Bop City and this is literally a bop. And another song I've really been into and I saw it in Claudia Saluski's favorites and I was like this song is so freaking good favorites youtuber that I really want to shout out Jen M I freaking love Jen like every time I watch one of her videos I'm just like I want to be like her when I grow up definitely link her channel down below I I think she's so beautiful she's so talented she's so driven and that's just something I aspire to be so I really look up to her I think that's all of my favorites and all the catching up that I think you guys need to know. <laughs> if you have any video ideas, please leave them down in the comment section below. I'd love to get you guys' opinion on what you guys want to see next. Like this video if you liked it and subscribe because why not? Follow me on all my social medias. I'll leave them listed down below and at the end slate at the end of this video. And I'll see you guys next time.